So, let me ask you something here. Do all NIV Bibles say the same thing from the time they were put out up until today? No, they don't. And I'm about to show you. They don't say the same thing. So, if you're fuzzing about, hey, you can't change God's word, well, guess what? The NIV did. They changed it. They went from being the International Bible Society to being Biblica. And I'm going to show you something here in the, 19, the uh, copyrighted 1984 edition of the NIV Bible. Of course, I'm using Isaiah 66, verse 2. Has not my hand made all these things, and so they came into being, declares the Lord? This is the one I esteem, who he who is humble and in contrite in spirit and trembles at my word. Of course, that is the newest, sorry, that's the oldest Bible version of the NIV. One of them, that's the second oldest, sorry. Now, let's go to the newest edition of the NIV and in into a um, kid's adventure Bible. The text uh, block, the Bible block is still the same thing. You know, nothing has changed. I had something very similar to this whenever my son was young. It was the NLT. And so, anyway, let's see what this one says. It says, actually, it says, no one Bible for kids. No, it's not. Okay. So, let's check this one out and go to the same chapter and verse. Okay, notice it says, these are the ones I look on with favor, those who are humble and contrite in spirit and tr who tremble at my word. Plural. Sorry, singular instead of tremble. Um. Anyway, to take the S off in any case. In any case. So, see, it says, this is the one I esteem. He who is humble and kind of tried to spirit and trembles at my word. And see, they change it here again. It might mean the same thing to some people, but, you know, it's the fact that the matter they changed it. And this was the International Bible Society, and this is Biblica. The International Bible Society became Biblica. See, you can see up into the copyright here, the Holy Bible and IV. Copyright 73 when it came out with the New Testament. 78 when it came out with the whole Bible in 1984. The second edition, the 2011 and third edition. So it's biblical now. It's not International Bible Society like this one right here. So it was by the International Bible Society. Now it's biblical. So to point out, worldly Bibles change. But the Word of God doesn't change. And doesn't have copyright in the authorized version. You get the authorized version and you compare it to the one of today, and you'll see it still says the same thing. Don't worry, we'll do other versions, I promise.